What is going on guys, Real Oliver 9912 here and today we are going to be doing a little multi-pack opening for the Panini Euro 2020 Tournament Edition Sticker Collection. So these multi-packs do contain 30 stickers and retail at 4 .99. You get 6 packets of 5 stickers each. Um, as you can see this is the Tournament Edition so now there's 3 collections. I would not mentioned this in my past 2 videos on this collection but there's 3 Euro 2020 collections. We had Road to UEFA Euro 2020 stickers, then we had the Euro 2020 preview and now the Euro 2020 Tournament Edition. So it's a bit of a mess but anyway the back is just plain and I think we're going to get into this and open up these packets. I really, what I would like ideally is more of the front page stickers. I think that would be very, very nice to get. I think when that's full, it's going to be one of the nicest pages in the album besides the England page. But anyway, we are in now, I'm pretty sure. Let's just uh, peel that back. And there we go. Uh, that's the multi pack in all its glory. So we do have, again, we have six packets which are glued on. So what I will do is I'll just tear off these packets now. They're very, very simple to tear off. This glue isn't really that strong. It's more like tape instead of glue, but still. Anyways, we've got all the packets torn off, so I think, without further ado, we just open up these packets and see what we get, guys. It's always exciting sticker pack openings, you know. Stickers probably are the most popular football collectible, especially these Euro stickers, because everyone's going to be wanting to collect the Euro and the World Cup stickers. So anyway, again with the packs, um, if you get them inside of like a bundle, they come with this little like violet purplish accent on the top, which I don't know why, but they just have that. No barcodes on these packets as well. So, first packet, let's see what we do get in this one. Come on, shinies please, I want shinies. Anyway, first sticker we do have Victor Tsizangov and Alexander Zinchenko. Then we do have Scott Kalmar and Adam Nangi. Then we do have Admir Memedi and Seferovic. We have Mikel Oyazabal there for Spain. A player that seems to be getting a lot more recognition recently. And then we do have Denis Zakaria for Switzerland. I signed him in my career mode last season for Wolves and he was honestly such a beast. If you play career mode, sign him. He's brilliant. Anyway, second packet. Um, I wonder whether we can get like any just... Any of the best players in the world, like Lewandowski would be nice as well. You know, Kane, just <sighs> Ronaldo, that'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? Anyway, we've got Robin Quanson, Quan Quanson, Quaison, uh, there for Sweden. Then we have Pepe and Guerrero, veteran centre-back there for Portugal, Pepe. Then we do have Ilya Zabani. Then we do, oh, and just as I said that, we've got Cristiano Ronaldo. That is absolutely lovely. What a sticker, there we go. That is beautiful. Might be one of his last major tournaments. It could be his last major tournament for Portugal, but I doubt that. I think he'll probably play at the World Cup next year. And to finish off, we do have Rabbit Matondo for Wales. I think Ronaldo deserves his own pile because he's just like one of the greatest players of all time. So we'll put him on there, put all those stickers there, and let's just continue on because, wow, what a pull that is, Cristiano Ronaldo. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's see if we can get any of his uh, teammates for Juventus. That'd be nice as well. Put them next to him, maybe. I'm not sure. Um, then we do have Dedrie Boyata uh, to start off this packet. We do have Gregoric. And, oh, we have a shiny. We have the Hungry Badge. That's a very, very nice badge, in my opinion, that. Then we do have Robert Mack. And we do have Damian Shishkovsky for North Macedonia. Of course, North Macedonia bet Germany last night, which I can't believe. That's an absolutely brilliant result for North Macedonia. I'm sure Germans will be absolutely kicking themselves at that. But anyway, moving on, we do have our next packet. We do have the shiny Russia badge. So two shinies and one multipack. That's not bad. We do have Luke Dion and Memphis Depay. Uh, Jua. We do have Milik and Piatek. Dries Mertens and Duhe Kaleta Kar there, who was rumoured to be going to Liverpool in the January transfer window, but he didn't end up going. Instead, they signed uh, who did they sign? Tom Davies and Ozan Kabak. I'm pretty sure um, instead of Duhay Kalekka. But anyway, continuing on, we do have Yevgen Makarenko. We have this amazing duo of Kimmich and Cruz, which I think sadly is a swap. 
We do have Ilkay Gundogan, which I think is also a swap. Granite Xhaka, which is a swap. And Antio Attila Fiola, which I think is a need. So that's that sort of redeems the pack a little bit. Anyway, final packet of this multi-pack. And we do get another shiny. Wow, that is three. That is that three shinies in one opening. That's a bit surprising. You hardly get any shinies in this collection. Anyway, we got the Czech Republic badge. We do have Jan Vertonghen there, uh, formerly of Spurs, now playing for Benfica. We do have Ihor Karatin. Then we do have Ryan Babel. And finally, to finish off this video, we do have Romelu Lukaku. Absolutely fantastic striker for Belgium and Inter Milan. So... If you did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like. It really does help out, as I've said in multiple of my videos now. Um, subscribe. Share this with your friends, actually. I'd like to see uh, some of you sharing my videos around, you know. Again, all of this really does help out the channel. So, this has been Real Oliver 912. You have watched my multipack opening. And, yeah. Peace.